When we put together our plans for the reopening of our school this September, I was determined we would give all our students, from the smallest in the nursery to the oldest in the co-educational college, the best educational experience we can, while adhering at all times to the current COVID controls. Whilst these may continue to change, I'd like to outline the measures we've already put in place for our staff and students at Howells. All students are in key stage bubbles. Students and staff move around the school following the new one-way system in the senior school and college, which is clearly signposted for anyone who forgets which way they need to go. All staff and students are required to wear masks or visors inside the senior school and college buildings in all communal areas. The youngest members of our school community are not wearing masks. Processes for drop-off and collection at the start and end of the school day have been designed to avoid mixing students from the different key stage bubbles and parents have been asked to remain in their cars as much as possible. Our school buses continue to run with enhanced safety measures, which include face coverings worn by the passengers and drivers at all times, and a seating plan to ensure students always sit in the same seat. Where needed, our classrooms have been arranged to have students as spread out as possible and all facing forward. Soft furnishings have been removed from around the school to make surface cleaning during the day as efficient as possible and we've changed the toys in the prep school, buying new, easily cleanable ones. Students are encouraged to regularly wash their hands or use hand sanitizer when hand washing is not possible. All activities which require close contact between students or staff have been paused, although extracurricular activities are still going ahead where possible. It's really important to me that we keep the extracurricular offer going. Now food is very important at Howells and our lunch times have also been staggered to ensure that student bubbles can eat separately but I'm pleased to say we're still providing a nutritious hot meal for everyone every day. All of our staff have received a formal briefing on Covid protection measures and close contact staff such as those working in the nursery and reception classrooms have been provided with full PPE. We have increased our cleaning capacity and invested in PPE and specialist cleaning products, including a foggy machine that can be used if an area needs sanitising. Whilst all these measures have been put in place to keep our school community safe, we are acutely aware that for both students and staff, the return to the school full of new rules and regulations could be a source of anxiety. With that in mind, the wellbeing team, including our school counsellor, are available at all times to assist with any worries, and students have been using their form time sessions to discuss their concerns with their form teachers who share them with me and the rest of the senior leadership team and we see what we can do to help. To be honest, in my entire teaching career this has been the biggest challenge I've ever faced. At times guidelines and regulations have changed on a daily basis but we have adhered to the guidance from Welsh Government as we have received it and we've been grateful for support and advice from the GDST on exactly how to implement all the guidelines. I am confident that we are doing everything within our power here at Howells to continue to provide an excellent and well-rounded education to all our students, while ensuring that both them and all our staff stay safe and protected in our school. <laughs>